I am Anil Kumar and we have equations with variables on both sides and this time we also have constants on both the sides. Let us see how to solve such equations. So step number one could be we could solve for the numbers and then we could solve for the variables. So let us first take care of the numbers. Minus 3 we want numbers all on the right side. So we will add 3 on both the sides. So we get 2x minus 3 plus 3 equals to 4x plus 1 plus 3. Now minus 3 plus 3 is 0 so we get 2x equals to 4x 1 plus 3 is 4. With the result we have constants only on the right side. Now let us get variables only on the left side. For that I have to take away 4x from both the sides. So we will do 2x minus 4x equals to 4x plus 4 minus 4x. 2x minus 4x is minus 2x, 4x plus 4 minus 4x, these two things become 0, you are left with 4. To get the value of x, what should you do now? You have to divide by minus 2 on both sides, so you get x equals to minus 2. So that is your answer for this particular question. Now we will follow the same strategy to solve the second question. You can actually pause the video, answer and then look into my suggestion. First step, get rid of numbers from left side or get the numbers on the right side. For that, we will take away 7 from both sides, correct? So we have 2y minus y minus 7. So on the left side, we are left with y. On the right side, 2y minus 12. Now, we will take away 2y from both sides so that we have only variables on the left side. Okay, so minus 2y. That gives us minus y equals to 2y minus 2y is 0 minus 12. Now to get the answer, we have to divide by what? Coefficient of y. In this case, it is minus 1. So we get y equals to 12. So that is the solution for this particular question. So I have a variety of examples for you with all kinds of solutions. Remember, at times, you may not have any solution for equations or at times, all possible values may be the solution. We'll get into such questions also. Thank you and all the best.